I'd like to use an example on that. And we had a client about 20 years ago, and it was the first time they went in a, for a defense contract, completely inexperienced. They hired us to help them along the way. And uh, early on, after they hired us, I said, what was it that made you choose us over someone else? And he said, you know, picking a proposal support company is like choosing an open heart surgeon. You don't know the questions to ask. All you know is if you're wrong, you die. <laughs> So it was a little dramatic, but I kind of understand what he was saying. And I said, okay, so why did you choose EXA? And he said, because when you responded to our request for proposal for help, you didn't just give us a bunch of names and, and, and rates, which is what one of your competitors did. They just said, here's the rates, go. You analyzed, the, as part of your proposal, you analyzed the RFP, you identified some of the trip wires in, those, in that RFP and things that, you, that we would have to pay attention to. You outlined a high level strategy about how are you going to approach this and then you provided us a, a notional outline of what the proposal was going to look like. And someone said to me, well, hey, we have everything we need to run with the proposal. And I, and I said, not me, but the guy talking to me said, are you nuts? Like, he's, he's just captured like the top skim of the layer of what we're going to have to do. We need to hire these guys in order to understand everything that feeds into that. So uh, that's the value that, that we add to our clients, that we've consistently added to our clients. We bring a solution. We don't bring bodies. Uh, we, we make sure we understand the solution and then we bring that solution and sometimes that solution takes a left turn part way through. We take a left turn with it and we make sure that we're responsive to our clients' needs at the beginning, middle, and end.